Okay, back on. You arrive at the surface of a strange planet. While walking, you notice the surface looks unlike any planet you've seen before. You notice the surface of this planet shines with an almost metallic sheen. And below your feet, you can feel tremors from what can only be massive machinery. Suddenly, an ancient being with a dog appears before you. I am Backel. I have followed your progress and seen you learn much. Come with me and I will show you more. Yeah, I'm not getting any hints from that. Okay, um... Alright then. I, I guess... Show me more, and machinery are my hints. Huh. I mean, I don't really consider 10,000 to be an increase, but I guess it's good for one of these. So, helpful? I think we're getting somebody who's being helpful. Oh yeah, these don't count. Uh... Probably just gonna do a short run here. Um, hmm. Or maybe I should just maybe I should just do a might run. I don't know. Curious what'll happen if I rebirth. Hmm. I think I'm just gonna set these guys to a three hour run and come back later. Yeah. Yeah, that's probably a reasonable thing to do. I'm making some more inferno equipment. I'm gonna overhaul some of the uh some of the uh gear on my teams. Alright, I'm gonna go with, um... I was gonna do a three hour run. What the hell? Let's see. Alright, seems good. Start. The Raven's decided he's good at all the campaigns that are not growth or item for whatever reason, so we can just run food camps, I don't mind. I guess, uh, no, multiply doesn't do anything. We need GP. Oh, shit, we need GP. That's right, that's right. Uh, okay, hold up. Small alteration here. Ah, uh, you can have the fool. Okay, we'll go with that. Yeah, we need a bunch of GP. Okay, next up, I'm just going to run a 12 hour run, yeah, at the end of it, we'll get a whole bunch of GP and things will be lovely. Okay, alright, so currently we've gotten this thing up to, well it's, it's reducing all damage by 34%, I want to push it a little further. 4% healing is, well, it's something, but I really need to get it to the point where it reduces pet damage by 50%. Um, I'm probably going to swap it out soonish, though. I'm probably not going to push it too, too far before uh, swapping into the others. I've still got a gnome and a taco to buff up a bit. I want to assemble them into an ultimate party of doom already. <laughs> Just keep leveling up for now. <sighs> hmm. I, I, ah, whatever. Anyway, I want to hunt mimics with them. I do. Hey, look, our first win. Anything happen? No? Nothing has changed. Nothing has changed yet. Mm. 
All right then. All right. Yeah, feed him. No additional clones. Also, the clones that died didn't increase my clone count any. Hmm. 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 Not really seeing anything else about this challenge yet. Well, <clears throat> I do have... Um... I don't know. I'll just put some percentages here. I don't know. I'll figure that out later. Uh, alright, well, uh, bump, 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 bump. That's a little bit better there. Hmm. Hmm. I can't tell that anything else is going on. There was just that 10,000 clone thing at the start. It didn't forbid me from purchasing more clones, so it's not locking me to 10,000. So I, I don't know what the gimmick is. Metal Planet, Sounds of Machinery, um... Oh. Yeah, I can't, I can't tell what else is up. So I'm just gonna keep running through this as normal and uh, we'll see what happens, I guess. All right then. Well, I haven't been able to figure out what this challenge is about. I mean, we got those, we saw those clones at the beginning, and I did end up with more clones um, as I went along, but it doesn't really seem anything out of the ordinary going on. So I've just been buying them uh, as I go, as usual. Everything's pretty much just the same. It's pretty much just the same. Just gather, just farm GP and CP, and you'll eventually win. I, I, I don't know. He gave me some shadow clones at the start. That was nice. But I can't tell anything else. I only need a little bit more, and I'll be able to max out those spectacles. Yeah, I'm going to have you do it. You never do anything. See these spectacles? Spectrometers here. Upgrades. Do I really have to do them one at a time like this? Okay. That's right. They're made out of pearls somehow. We're grinding pearls into the lenses. Okay. I need only 600 more. No, correction. I only need... 381 more and the spectrometers will be to the limit then all I need out of the challenge is a couple thousand more so I can get that pet token I wish I could buy some of these but that's just not gonna happen if I had done nothing else and just bought these I would have only gotten 22 which is actually kind of a pathetically low number Hmm. Clearly not a good source there. I kind of wish I had made this thing an alchemist. It takes 12 days, 13 days almost, to make nothing with the hammer. But, I mean, if I had it working on, I don't know, torches or something, they could be done in a more reasonable time frame. I don't know. Yeah, okay, whatever. It's a shame that I have to sleep, that I have not yet learned to shed this obnoxious habit of laying around lazing about all night. But anyway, uh, otherwise I'd have finished this one in about a day and a half. But, you know, now I'm going to go to bed for eight hours, and so, uh, so you know, whatever. Anyway, uh, so... We had an update, and it changed a couple of small things, and made two important changes. The first is, 
I can give this guy a uh, token to make him a significantly better assassin. He does damage that ignores defense. Defense armor piercing damage. Anyway, he does, does extra damage. It pierces armor. A pretty good thing. Only works if he's an assassin, just in case you wanted to try anything creative. No, screw you. No creativity allowed. He's going to be an assassin, and we're going to make sure he stays an assassin. Game, you can't tell me what to do. I seriously am still thinking about making him an adventurer anyway. Oh no, Hydrix, what are you thinking? You have way too many adventurers. Why would you want another one? Well, let me tell you. I'm kind of thinking I don't want to use him as an assassin at all. I'm kind of thinking I just want to keep running food campaigns, especially since I got this guy. Especially since this guy's a thing, I've, I'll be wanting to just run food campaigns forever. And having a pet whose stats are significantly higher than everyone else's, which by the time this guy can evolve, he'll have the highest stats of any of my pets, and I could just keep pushing his stats higher and higher and higher by continuing to do food campaigns, which I already intend to keep doing food campaigns anyway, so why not just keep him as an adventurer and just have the biggest pet ever? That's probably why this was put here, as temptation to make you use him as an assassin instead of just growing him forever. Well, gotta admit, it's pretty good. Sounds good. Sounds real good. I'll have to think about it. Does evolving change his minus 300% of food campaigns? I mean, as an adventurer, he'd level up anyway, and if I ever decided to class change him into an assassin, he'd have gained a ton of class levels as an adventurer, and then I'd just spend a token to switch him over. So, if I want to keep him in the food campaigns, even if he's not, even if being an adventurer isn't going to make him any good at it, it'll still let him gain class levels. It's still valid. Still a valid option, just one I have to think about. Because I have other assassins who honestly seem like they'd be even better. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> it seems pretty good. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Well, I'm going to rebirth now. And I think I'm actually going to hang on to my GP at this point. I think I'm just gonna gonna hang on to it for a little bit here. Yeah. Okay. Uh, what I need to do most is. Hey you. It's not like you're doing anything. I see you there doing nothing. Well, I want. Oh, I could just use the octopus. Whatever. Fine. <laughs> Too late. All right, spectrometers, upgrade. All right, 20% chance of not using any materials. But you don't have a robe of economy yet. I need to make a second robe of economy if I'm going to make more tier 3 materials or tier 4 materials. If I'm gonna have this dragon over here forging materials for me, what a pain in the butt. I need to make a super hammer, and I need to make a super cauldron. Uh, I need to then I can actually make weapons and armor. It's fine. It's fine. Everything's fine. It's fine. Can you tell I'm a little bit annoyed? <laughs> I didn't want to make another robe of economy. 
Yeah, I should probably be running the wind tower. I'm still le power leveling things in the volcano. Um, I'm getting extra phoenix feathers is cool and all, but uh, all right, I'm gonna give you some nothing. There you go, 99 should be enough. Let's see what happens when you hunt mimics. You've gotten up to a 36% damage reduction. This group only has one real damage dealer, but it's one hell of a damage dealer, so I guess that's okay. In a couple more levels, I'll, what, ready or not, I'm going to switch the salamander out for gnome. Got to keep, got to keep leveling these things. Hmm. Hmm. Anyway, I have a whole bunch of pets that need to do a whole bunch of stuff. So let's see. In this case, I'm actually going to go for the 10 hour run. Sorry, guys. Scheduling being what it is. Uh, yeah, whatever. I know I'm going to rebalance my teams again soon. Okay, so well, there's actually one th other thing that they did, and it's uh, oops, it's arguably even more important, and that is overflow points had a major change. Actually, they had several tweaks, but the big important one is there's no longer the ability to purchase light clones. Instead, increase the level of space dim elements by one percent. This boost is additive with Road to Infinity. Body is cheap. Oh wow! Oh wow! That just just jumped from oh. Oh, that's not so inexpensive. Okay. Well, I'll probably want to bring that up to at least five percent, which isn't much, but whatever. It's five percent boost. It's good. Five percent is five percent. What can you say? It's still good. All right. Uh. Normal people get eight hours of sleep, but normal people are sane. So what do they know? Okay, see that? You need to do something with those hooves of yours. Idle hooves or the devil's playground or something like that. Okay, there I go. Ah, you! No! Get out! I'm gonna put you, and you, who else might be a, a noxious problem right now? Other things might be obnoxious problems right now. Possibly. Alright, can I get... 10? Ten, 10 pets? All in the thing? Okay. Alright. Good! Excellent! Okay, you guys can come out now. <laughs> How is the, uh... Okay, we're looking good there. Only a thousand something points until I can't even allow to see what the pro costs of the next upgrade are. <sighs> should I start making freaking ale? Probably. I should probably be making ale right now. Uh-uh. Uh-uh. There you guys go. All right, to beach. All right, that's that, that's all fine. GP. Yeah, gather some GP. And divinity. Okay. Yeah, okay. Anyway, we'll leave it at that. We'll leave it at that. So... Oh, hurried up. Oh, yeah. yeah. I've been using a lot of these. 
because I'm impatient. Well, I guess you don't need that. Not really. Alright, and we'll just hang on to 167 GP. I mean, I could buy things with it, but... Uh, I could just do this a few times. Uh, but nah, 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 nah. Okay, anyway. We're looking pretty okay, I guess. Things look good. Alright then. Yeah, when I wake up, I'll definitely just get the win. No problem. That. Let us see two things. First, what's the next one? Kentorax. Uh, he looks exhausted. I draw close to him. Yes, you stay a while and listen. Oh, he's Decker Kane, I see. Da -da 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 -da. Skyrim reference, meme. I don't. How does. What's his. I don't know what that. What does that mean about your challenge? What are you going to do? Also. Uh, also, also, planet level is 9001. I did notice that that was at 9001. I should have mentioned that. Yeah, there was. Uh, UB multis can't go below 50% of base. Okay, I didn't notice that. Defender clones are five times as strong. I never even used defender clones. <laughs> I was just directly killed things. Planet gives 50% plus 50% divided by two hours of its multi is RB Monument Multi. Didn't notice that. The RB Multi is removed if the challenge takes longer than five days. Uh, complicated. Yeah. I mean, I did use, I did use the planet, uh, Multiplier a bit. Yeah, I didn't know that the things were five times as strong. If I had known that, I would have been using them. I would have definitely been using the, uh. Well, whatever. Now I have to fight a Skyrim guard. S Skyrim, what, what, what do you do to my. How is this challenge going to be different? I don't know. Alright, well, whatever. Um, I don't want to start a new one until I collect my dungeons, so... It's going to be another three hours till I start it. And it didn't even mention the fact that he gave me some clones to start with, which was also a thing that happened. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. Part of me feels like I should just look these up as I take them on. <laughs> Since so often I can't figure out what has to what has changed exactly. Yeah, I'd been wondering about the nine thousand and one thing, wondering about it. Yeah, now back down to one fifty one. It should have occurred to me that was the challenge. I noticed it and then I was just like that's a one. That's a strange. Oh, this is a day challenge and other things. And how's my planet level nine thousand and one? Is this a joke? It's over nine thousand. It's a joke, right? Huh. Oh, it's not April Fool's Day. Why would there be? <laughs> I never thought. Oh, that's the challenge. Because I expect the challenge to do like one thing. I expect each of these challenges to do like one thing, not a variety of things. Hmm. Okay. 
Yeah, I think all the other ones did generally do one thing for the most part. Hmm. Well, all right then. Well, all right then. Uh, I wish one of these were offering me GP right now. But I got the only one that does already in the thing. Okay, I only need 48 more. I'll get 30 from this. Uh, there's no good way to get just 18. Hmm. What about you? Am I strong enough to do this? Am I? <sighs> Am I? You know what? You, 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 know, you know what? I think I'm going to try for it. I think I'm going to try for it. Okay, hold on. Feed all to full. Alright. Alright, I'm just gonna go for this. And uh, discover if I've become strong enough to win yet. Yeah. There we go. Hmm. Because I have more shadow clones than I used to. This hasn't really been relevant to the challenges and things I've been doing lately. But it is a good thing to have. I, I might have enough shadow clones that I can do damage. Hmm. All right then, we're gonna try it. That's a good thing to do with these these few hours here. Yeah, we'll find out if I can I can possibly beat this thing. If I could, I mean that would be that would be really good. That might be even yeah yeah. Let's hope let's hope I can beat it in a timely manner. Well, this is not promising. One-shotted by this thing. And we have to beat the one after that. It's really a question of can I survive being hit a single time. If I can do damage, then I can win. But I'm not sure that I can. I want to go ahead and pump this up a little bit been wanting to for some time, but... <sighs> well, that's as far as I can take it for the moment. Not having GP won't have a big impact on me uh, while I'm running these... while I'm running certain challenges. But it is annoying, and I'll have to gather it again, and I really need to get a higher creation count. Anyway, we're pushing, pushing this back. Can I just... Drat! Can I just... Um... I really wish that there was a cheaper price on these. This is only a hundred thousand. Do you know how much it would cost me to fill up? I have to click this two thousand times! <laughs> Can't we get a better version of this? That's 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 more cost efficient, please. Shit, I'll just have to wait. This is with a creation crystal too. Uh here, we'll do this. Alright, there you go. Bonk. Bonk. Uh, 
There we go. All this well. All right, we've got a faster creation count now. <sighs> Just because I can. Anyway, whatever. This is still going to take too long. Uh, I'll I'll keep experimenting. Uh, all I need to know is I can withstand one hit. If I can, actually, there are things we haven't done yet. Mystic Defense, UBV2, UBV4, HP Recover Speed. Okay. Increases the HP of your Shadow Clones. What I need... You know what, I'm just not going to give up. I'm going to go all in on this thing. I'm going to do it if it takes me all day. We're going to have... There's nothing else that plugs into this, I'm pretty sure. So it's just going to be all about Mystic Regen, Physical HP, and... Uh, We'll come back at this. I thought I could... I thought... Uh, anyway, it doesn't matter what I thought. Uh, meanwhile, as for you all, you can go ahead and do the dimensional beamer. It was on my mind. I needed to pump this anyway. So... Yeah, because this will give me what I need. Even though the reward is otherwise useless to me during these challenges just getting the challenge points and finally unlocking the tavern slot has some value. Some value. More quest slots would be ideal too, but you can't have everything now. Well, eventually you can. If you're patient enough, all things come to he who waits. There's actually a better quote. I like the, I think it was Abraham Lincoln, all things come, or, or things do come to those who wait, but only those things left by those who hustle. I think that's the quote. Anyway, doesn't apply to a, to an idle game, obviously. Alright, anyway. Alright, thinking about the routing a little bit, it's gonna be... Space Dim Speed, which requires a Blacksmith, which I think you are, my, might be my second strongest Blacksmith, okay, and then Space Dim is actually going to go for Recursive Memory, so we're boosting our Might Speed. When this has gone far enough, I then shift this to the mite over here. And uh, I might as well get my GP from the black holes. Seems, seems worthwhile. But yeah, I should bring this up to at least a thousand before I switch to the beamer. At least a thousand before we start training. And I think I think that'll be a little bit better. A wee bit better. Yeah, Sebastian here. Doing his part. Mm. I mean, it couldn't hurt, just a little bit. You know, get some more GP back. It's not a bad a bad thing to put just a little bit into. I can take away. Well, my alchemists are busy. They're very busy doing nothing. Nah. Yeah. Yeah, okay. Uh, there you go. Alright. Awesome. So when that thing kicks in... Oh yeah, that reminds me. Okay. So when that thing kicks in, it'll be boosted. Ha-ha! Every 
three, uh, three, more than three and a half hours, three and three quarters of an hour, we will get three GP. Woo! <laughs> All right, whatever. 250 is good enough for you. All right, do the space dim. Okay. Now everything should be flowing well. <sighs> we have three more days of this. You know, once this event ends, it'll I'll actually be able to run more efficiently on the uh, challenges. I'll be able to do a full GP camp and a Divinity camp at the same time. The Divinity can have its uses, you know. Poor Packle. I'm sorry I wasn't able to figure out your challenge. You gave me all these wonderful bonuses and I did not use them efficiently because I didn't know what they were. Hmm. So but I'm, I'm, I'm probably going to try to figure them out and then look them up within a few hours of starting them. Henceforth, that way I can actually play the challenge. Because sometimes I'm able to figure out the, what, what's going on. But, uh, sometimes I just fail to understand what's going on. I fail. Mm. All right, anyway, uh, yeah. I'm tempted to build up a whole bunch of other things just because they're, they're, they're good for me. Like, yes, I want more pet stones. Yes, I want my pets to get more growth from their food. Yes, uh, but no. Focus. Focus, Hadrix. Focus on the current problem. Hmm. I want to do another RTI and get this bonus higher. And evolve my tree, of course. Uh, all right. Anyway. We should also build this up between... Between shows. Anyway, whatever. All right. So, that was way easier than I expected it to be. So I end up finishing it faster than I thought I would. Anyway, I now have a third tavern quest. All three are now mine. I can run three concurrent. Ah, these are a little bit expensive. It's going to take me a while to gather these, but... Well, what can you do? Alright. Collect. 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 I'll take that too. I'll take those. What's this? Okay, you can have that. No, no, not yet. Not yet. I'm saving that. Uh, we need... I need to put a certain fella into that. Get that one started. That one doesn't drop any GP or anything, unfortunately, but it's, it's fine. The curse, however, this one is worth some. So we're just going to sit on that a little bit longer. All right, and we're about to begin our next thing. Ah, uh, yeah. It took a long time to get that third quest. We're within a thousand of getting up to uh, finally A rank quests too. So we're gonna we're gonna be getting that going too. Yeah, everything went good here. All right, how did we do here? 10, 10, 10, and we didn't get lose fight, good. 14 shiny stones tells me I got a bunch of mimics. We're not getting as many phoenix feathers and items out of this, but that's okay. That's okay. 
Yeah, I didn't even use any phoenix feathers. We actually did really good. Really, really good. Impressive. Alright, good work, guys. So, my salamander is more strong than ever before. We're up to 37%. I really need him to be at 50, but I kind of want to train other pets now. I'll let the salamander continue a little bit more. Alright, and of course we need wood. One annoying thing, I want to start setting up for the next, uh... This is the one that keeps falling. Not you. But you. Hmm, interesting. Anyway. Let's go ahead, feed all, uh, unleash might, because why not, a quick rebirth, you might as well turn that off. Wah! Yeah, because, I mean, you know, you gotta, you gotta collect you gotta collect this little bit, right? Yeah, you totally gotta. Okay. Oh wow, he's just still only up to that, huh? That's fine. Okay, now go further. There you go, you got the weather. Put that there, put that there. Very good. Rebirth. Buy more meat! So yeah, I was starting to say, I'm blocked from being able to see this. I can't actually see what the upgrade cost is until I get to the point where I'm allowed to do it. So that I don't know how much meat... I, it might change the type of wood, it might do anything, and I can't see the cost. We might, as long as we don't discover we suddenly need super ale, I guess I'm okay, right? Anyway, that's good enough. We're gonna... I find a little bit more. <laughs> One more time. Ha! Okay, let's go. Next one, begin... Not gonna go away, OC. Yes. Okay. So our hint didn't really help me all that much. However, I've got this. Boom. It's only 12 GP. But that's something at least. All right, what should we hit up? I think... Wait, am I using... You're already doing many problems. Okay, it's going to be the lottery with a blacksmith and an alchemist. Oh, no, a blacksmith. Where's a blacksmith? Where are all my blacksmiths? Oh no. Okay, hold on a second. Hey you, hermit crab. Yeah, you. I need you. Okay. Ahem. So we'll get 20 GP. There we go. Ba-dump! And looks to me like I'm going to want to set a couple of these up. I actually want to run Trapped Fairy. Zoo is always asking for all kinds of things I can't ever give. Lock picking. You want a rogue to do it. Well, there's no GP in it for me, but uh, what can you do? A rogue shall get involved. And, uh... Oh! Who? I need to set another one up. Oh, well, I can't. Too bad. Okay. There we go. Yeah. Mm hmm. So, okay, for my next trick. Boop! How about that? 
And for my next trick, I go over here. Oh, yeah, these uh, stuff. Whatever, good enough, right? Oops. It's fine. Okay, uh, specifically, all this goes into Create Speed. And it helps me jumpstart things. Kentorax. Kentorax, what are you up to? I have no idea. Oh, I sure wish I could help you level, but I really can't right now, so let's just hope those 500 levels are good enough. Uh, this will be a sh short thing. A short, short thing. Um, no, beach. Definitely beach. Okay, who took you? Wrong! Well, that'll work. GP, and the last two, um... Um... I'm just gonna put you two here for the moment, okay? If only I had just a tiny bit more pet stones, I could buy one more and then I could set set somebody to do something else. Maybe just eggs, maybe assassins, I don't know. Anything. Anything. Meanwhile, you all... What? Twelve hours. Yep. Yep. This is the best way to gather... GP and, uh... Oh, the base materials, but GP is the important bit. I want to shift more into the infinity dungeons, but, uh, no rush on that, no rush. So, uh, yeah, we need... We're gonna need to do the thing what we always do. That's right, it's going down. Good work. Good work. It's gonna start going up before it reaches zero or one or whatever. Anyway, we're back into these. Two days left on this. I'm pretty sure I can get that pet token. So that'll be good. I'm not even entirely sure if these are worth 300 apiece. I, I don't, I don't know. Oh, you know, if I just trade for some pet stones right now, right now, I could get one more slot. <sighs> yeah, no, 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 never mind. Terrible idea, let's not do it. 